All right, emergency uh, high council. I guess the <laughs> this is ha- have we lost the locker room? Um, and this is all Enrico Bosco, his return. I've been seeing the clips starting. Uh, I guess you got Chaps, Brandon Walker, um, just killing him. Killing Rico, saying he's basically dead. I saw uh, Kevin, you and Fidelberg talking, being like, I wouldn't say you didn't have the same anger that, like, Chaps is mad mad, uh, like, as mad as you can really be. Uh, I think Brandon is more like you guys are crazy. Like, like how the fuck can you bring this guy back? I'm, I'm, uh, I'm just, the hypocrisy kills me from Rico. Like, the amount of times that we have had conversations about that stuff and then for him to be one of those people is fucking insane so like you know if cons is is okay like i'm not gonna be like beat up about it or freaking out about it but i'm just like you're done that's crazy and let, and let me clarify the cons thing the way it went down so rico starts asking his way back cons is like you know about the what happened right i'm like i got no idea this is after it was already gone then he wants to come back and I get filled in by Dan and what happened. I, so, and then Rico, we had planned to talk to me. And I was like, Rico, all the other stuff aside, like the con stuff so far over the line, before, so before anything, you have to talk to him and he has to give you a blessing. Before I could even alert cons, he called him right away. Like, I think he went, click, call cons. So, um, cons texted me. He's like, I talked to Rico and then I called cons and I'm like, listen, I don't know what was said, but if you feel you'll get any blowback from, from me or Dan or anything, like, I don't care. He left. If you're point zero 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 one upset, he's gone. And cons to his credit, because a lot of people have said it, he's like, you know, I'm not a grudge guy. What he did is fucked up. He has a... Kids, like, I I don't know what he'll do if he doesn't do this. And he's like, so I'll just move on. So I truly, in my heart, it was, I didn't get the vibe. And I know, and even today, Cons was like, texting me, he's like, thank you how you handle it. Like, Cons is not bullshitting. He he really let it go. Now, everyone else has the right to be fucking furious. But to your point, Kevin, and this is where I wrestle it, Rico's crazy. And he, like, when I say crazy, like, he should be on meds, lunatic. I actually don't think in his world he even gets what he's doing. I know that's, like, a cop-out, but he's fucking off the reservation. I mean, I don't disagree with you, but when your whole fucking act is some things are bigger than sports, and I'm a man of honor and family and this and that, and and the the conversations we've had— he brings up the stuff that like I've gone through with people with burners and attacking my family. hundred percent. Gone through my kids. He always uses me as an example as why he doesn't want to do this world, and then he's fucking one of them. Yeah, no, you have every right to be upset, and but but all I'm saying, I agree with you. People are gonna be like, "You're covering him." I said this from the beginning. I don't think he gets what you just said. Like, I, I think he is that insane where, like, he has to be on meds. I'm not just saying it. But, Kevin, like, do you, this, this started, I saw this today, I think it's true. The reason he doesn't like cons is because cons was short with him at a baseball game. Like, yeah, I'm he, sure. I'm sure it's something comes crazy. Ridiculous. But then he goes on. I mean, he wouldn't, he wouldn't save his cousin's bar and do a podcast and to do. His yeah. cousin owned a bar that needed barstool fund money. He, COVID, so yeah. he, he, he puts a line in the sand in this moral honor courage. I think he thinks he is being that doesn't excuse it. He's, no, he's a, yeah, he's I, a I, horrible I, it's human. Like, it's like you're dealing with a literal child then, but one, one, uh, one half of him thinks that he can like, speak on on these these issues and draw a line in the sand and be the moral high ground and then when shit goes wrong it's like oh i don't know 100 percent. you're you're absolutely right bullshit yeah 100 percent. so i I mean i i've been getting fucking hammered online rightfully so i own it like i didn't 
my all right so i'll tell you my my timeline here kevin just because you probably don't know the details i was with dave this weekend rico called me on friday he broke down he was crying and talking about how can he you know support his family how can he support his kids all this stuff like i that hurts me personally being like this guy is not going to be able to ha- like live right and i was like 50 50 I don't know. Dave and I talked about it. The cons thing was a major issue. I completely agree. And people who were like, Dan, you keep your life private. Would you let him back? I probably wouldn't. So cons is a better person than me. Con- Here's cons text. Cause I asked him, I was like, can I read your text? Just cause this is where I'm coming from when I thought, and I misjudged it. I misjudged it, but this is what con said. And this is shows the, the character of cons. He said, Rico just called me and apologized for everything. Seemed like a very sincere apology. Sounded remorseful. I'm not one to hold any grudges. If he were here to, if he were to come back, I don't have any ill will towards him water under the bridge as far as I'm concerned. And then I said, that's great to hear. Like it's great to hear. And he said, listen, I, I didn't appreciate that he had a hand in harassing my wife, but she and I have a better relationship than to let something like that hurt us. I think he genuinely needs this company. I can respect that he swallowed his pride and apologize because I know that's not easy for him. So when and on top of that, that, I called him because right. he, he said something similar. I didn't believe it. I was like, let me talk to him. But again, the, in, he, in it, the point, though, about needing the company and like, so Rico's crying to me on Friday. Cons is saying to me on Sunday, like, hey, I'm a bigger man than than him. Like, it's fucked up, but I'm cool with it. So I go from that to being like, well, OK, like, let's try to repair. It. And I also just want to say, like, I know people are very mad. I get it. I should be shit on. People were like, Rico's just back. He's not just back. He was on Pick'em. He's at zero with me. He's got to go to therapy. He's got to unblock everyone. He's got to do content with Nadu. If he fucks up even a little bit, he's gone. So it's not like I'm I'm pretending like I will this say happened. though, Dan, I, I was thinking along everything that's happened today. If I were Rico, I probably would have tweeted at Chaps, been like, you're right. Like yeah, to right. everybody. He, 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 right. he is what he has done or not done today in reaction to everything. I agree with that. Far worse than any of the, yeah. like, the he overplayed his hand with his negotiation and, and that was bad. What what transpired today has ruined his I, I will agree that totally. he is again showing signs that he totally don't got it, which he doesn't got because no. y- you should be out front, be like, I deserve, I eat it. I would have called chaps, to be honest, I would have called him to do. Be like yeah, I, I listen, I've been, that's what uh, I told but he hasn't done any of it on his own yet. Right. He's not going to unless you guys tell him to. No, and you're right. And I, 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 I've, that's a I've red thought flag. about it because we t- we did pick him, and I was like, I'm going to help Rico. I maybe I just won't help Rico because maybe that's the right move because it's it's true that like it's not fair that I'm showing him any because there's type no of way you can take the cons apology, which right. cons openly says is probably just because I was like, if you don't do that. You're not coming back. And then he did it. But he hasn't talked to Nadu. He hasn't talked to Chaps or anyone else. So that's a red flag. Now, I saw your tweet, Kevin, about like the comparing the instance with, you know, Rhea and, and and Hank and things like that. I personally, they're they're both bad. I don't think like judging I will say. If you put well, no, yourself, Rico's is way worse. Rico's no, is way I worse. I don't necessarily agree with that. Oh, dude. Rico's come on. is way worse. Come on. Rico's you, is way you, worse. Harassing oh, a, a, a a civilian, someone who's not in this well, world. That's great. Here's, here's the thing. Hey, that's that's, that's the thing. Up, like in in some instances, if you take that too far, that's fucking like actually illegal. So yeah. you know, one thing is like in poor taste, and we're talking about. I think feelings. they're both the bad. Thing is like illegal, dude. He, here's I, the I, thing. I think they're both bad. The the Marty thing. I the the craziest part about today is people being like. You you said you weren't gonna fuck with Marty, and now you're doing this Rico. Those same people, if you remember, after I said that with about Marty, a week later, I was like, I'm not gonna hold a grudge because I can't. I apologize to Marty. We we made our amends. I've helped him since he. I think he's gonna get resigned here. Like he loves Barstool, but those people were calling me a pussy and a middleman for 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 like reneging on being like Marty's dead to me. I. Rico is is got a lot more building back than Mar- like I I was to Marty I basically was like we're cool man like it's fucked up whatever I probably overreacted you probably should have told us like whatever it is Rico is in way more of a like Marty was good with me for a week after Rico's not going to be good with me 
for months. He has to build all of it back. Like See, everything I, I, it's back. It's weird because I, I think I thought I, I, I was, and I know I'm right, that Rico is a nutty person. So it's like as crazy as what he did, it's like not crazy to me. I will say the people saying other companies, like Barstool is not the content part. You can't compare it like who, how would anybody at another company have this no. job? Well, we're, we're a shit show, a reality show. And to be honest, what I was going to say, Kevin, it, and it's hard, but let's say Rico was a bit character or a character role player in KFC radio for 10 years. And you liked him, but you know he's fucking crazy. And he goes and does something that's like, oh, what'd you do that? You're probably going to be more likely. Like, I do like Rico, even though I know he's a jerk. Like, and, and I've said that. So it's like, I do, like, to what Khan said, and Dan and I talked a little about it a little bit, I don't know what he'll do if he's not here. And that's not a reason. That's, that's his own the, thing so, that he's that, built. That's, I mean, I get it. I get it. But, like, we're talking about, about like, strike at least three. <laughs> On right. like, or, but you know, but cons, but things. but the oh, flip side is con like yes, but cons. And, and, and I also can I can let all of that go because it is a wacky fucking place that we work at, and everything. When you sign up here, you sign up for a lot of stuff. His wife did not. She didn't sign up for anything. Oh, totally. No, I agree. But person. we have crazy. But you want to know how crazy this is? I was trying to explain. I this was going to say Dan before. He tried. Do you know who he tried? <laughs> I don't even know how to say this with a straight face. So Rico has lost control of some of his own lieutenants. He went to Jersey Jerry. Yeah, no, I know. Who has his own yeah, army yeah. and Jerry asked one to of his borrow yeah. one of his top guys to do the hit. But like, what are we? What are we even talking about? Way, just lieutenants. to clarify, no, just so to clarify, crazy. Jersey Jerry's guy said it's too murky for him. He can't do it. I said, can I see? this exchange because I want to see just how bad this is, what the hit was described as And Jersey Jerry's guy. He goes, I couldn't do it. Uh, I, it was, it was, it was two black ops for me. And I deleted all of the messages, just like you taught us in boot camp, boss. Oh. I was like, what am I looking at? It's the loony bin. It's, it's yeah, the loony crazy. bin. And I, again, I don't really know, like, People are going to be mad at me for a long time, I would imagine, for this. And I really, like, Rico's not back with me. You know what I mean? But like, mad he's, at what? He's, like, they're I mad. Get, that, like, they're mad. They, they think I'm a hypocrite, which I can understand because I keep my private life private. And then, like, it, and I've said that if he did this to me, I would be, I'd be like, no chance. So they're right in that. Stuff. It, though, it's cons is who he did it to. Yeah. Con, the, the problem that but I keep that, going back to where, is cons. That's where people have the problem is because when, when, Hank and Rhea's stuff, went, uh, Marty and Rhea's stuff went down. Hank was like, I'm good. But that's why I took his lead. I took his lead, and I went and I went to Marty, and I, I said, I'm, I'm gonna sorry. Say right. I, 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 I'm going to say this and no. We were, we were moving desks. and Well, and, yeah, I mean, because uh, I had to move a desk because like, Hank didn't want to be I'm, around. I'm, I'm going to say something in no uncertain terms. That message was never given to me, period. That Hank was okay with everything? Never was given to me. Never. And it could, that's, I'll leave it at that. That Hank was fine with the way that went down was never given to me. And, it, and now, if, it, if it was, would you have just left it alone? A hundred percent. Okay. Cause that's, that's where I think it's like in, in both cases, first of all, one is, is everybody who works at Barstool and everybody's decided to sleep with each other and, and things got messy, but it's everybody who works at this company. The, the main person who was hurt or harmed or involved was asked, are you good? And he said, yes. Now, I guess so it wasn't related to you, but that's how it, it appeared to me. It was like, we're not going to listen to the fact that he's okay with it. And we went all in on this. That, guy. that, that so message that was unequivocally on. never delivered like, yeah, just uh, this doesn't bother me at all. Let that wasn't, and I will say, I think both of them would say like I'm okay. like cons. I'm not saying that cons is losing sleep over it, and I'm sure he's like the, he's being a a class act and like it's all good. But he's not like okay with it. He's not right. happy about yeah, it. Yeah, no, like, totally. I, I, you know. I, I I don't. Because people there is are obviously a... going to say that he was forced to do it. I don't know what to do other than take him for his word when he says that he's like he's a he's, We've talked I, I, to cons. I've yeah. talked about. It. He's like I believe in second chances. The guy's fucked up. 
and I don't know what he would do without this job. And that's I get that message off the heels of Rico being like, I don't know how I'm going to feed my family without this yeah, job. Yeah. I don't really know. Like, no, it's, I don't it's, know. And what by to the do. way, there is something to be said where people I'm a hell of a lot closer to Hank and even Rico than I am con. So it's like, yeah. you're obviously somebody that was with me in Milton. You're going to get your hackles go up more faster. That's human nature. It's like, he's, that's what I'm saying. If it was someone like, I know how fucked up Rico is. I know he's fucked up, but this is, this is last chance you for him. And that may be it. We don't, we, I, we're not the, we're not the red cross United nations. He's burned a ton of opportunities. No, I'm, I'm, I don't, but I'm he's in trouble if he ain't here. I'm at zero with him. And I don't know, like I make, he has to go to therapy. I, I, I guess I just keep coming back to like, I, I feel like in a fucked up way, bad for how fucked up he is in the head. So it's like, I yeah, want I mean, that's, but that's him to be like, okay. But I don't know. I also don't know, like him not being here feels like it's going to be a really bad situation and and maybe this isn't my like i was talking to kirk kirk's like that's sh that's not your responsibility and he's probably right like i should probably just wash my hands of all of it i should well, i mean you, you you guys are not like his keeper you're not his i know watcher and i know yeah you guys got history but it's also like fuck man you know it, it just it's like it, it's i know we uh, we you always say we treat different people differently at Barstool, but it's like you throw a can at someone's head and you're harassing somebody's wife. Bad. And if we let those things go, then what? I mean, what do you got to do well, here to even? Well, I, right. I, I, I right. agree with you. I agree with you. That makes sense. But he's a psychopath. So, like, what? That's he not is... helping your case, Dave. No, no uh, but he, no, but what I'm saying is like we don't have to worry. That somebody's gonna be like, oh, Rico tried to murder somebody with a high noon can because he's a psych like a normal person, right? Right. right. He, we're dealing with a total lunatic, and, and but and who knows? Who knows if he has it in him to to change? But I do think I mean you're right. Like Ke Kevin, you said it. Like the way he's dealt with today is terrible because he terrible. I mean, like he should. It's alarming. If he's actually going to change, he needs to mend. I told him he needs to mend every fence. He needs to go on his hands and knees to every person he's wronged at this company. He has to go to therapy. He has to unblock people. Like I'm not treating it like he's back and it's hunky dory. And I am moving his desk too because I don't want to be around him. Like I'm not. And well, maybe I should just that, that like walk away. Like a, who are you gonna put him next to? That's I don't know, like but I don't want him around me. That's I don't want him around me. Like I, uh, he most pretty much only does. Marty's coming back probably. Marty will sit next to me again. <laughs> he, he probably he only really does content with you guys, right? But like, I I mean I just can't even imagine walking the halls if I was him anymore. Like, like there's well, like, the, like, I, like there, there, there's been issues in the past with with employees, and there's team this and team that, and a line in the sand. And, and it's usually 50 50 or whatever i mean this is like well let, all right I mean, you guys yeah, let, only, only and, and right. let me say this and i could be wrong about it and i could be wrong about it we uh, there's people in the world who are just unlikable regardless you're like i don't like that person and most people are like i don't want to be around like nate unlikable like you know, like no one's dying to hang out with nate all the time if, if you're not on Rico's magical shit list, he's a pleasant enough person. So all I'm saying is if he can change and actually apologize and get a chaps or a Nadu to be like, all right, you know what? You're a crazy person, but I can see you're trying to change. I, he, he can come back, I think, but he may not be capable of it. Nadu's the big one to me because Nadu, want, Nadu reached out to me and said that he's like, Let's 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 make this work. So well, if the dude's offered that, that, then it's like I don't want to talk problem. to him. You're talking, you're talking about guys who are at the end of the day like good dudes, like upstanding guys who don't really hold grudges and or or aren't interested in like having a war with Rico. So they're gonna be like, yeah, man, it's all you know. You apologize, it's okay. Like Cons was today, and nobody wants to be like the the bitch who's like you know, acting butthurt over something. So they're, they're all, everybody, all, everybody else in the company would probably be like, yeah, it's fine. Let, let bygones be bygones. But I, you know, this is a guy who, who couldn't, he can't even like swallow his pride on like 
silly fucking, you know, don't got me jokes on Twitter. And, you know, like, well, he's never been able to own up to anything. He, he alone, apologized to Gottlieb. You know, he, 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 he can't, he can't be at the Christmas party without throwing a fit. He can't. I, you're do you right. know why? Do you know? Do you know, to, like, Kevin? Do you know why? His... Do you know why he he attacked Khan's his wife? Just because of his grudge with Khan? Why? Yeah, what sparked it? The when he scored the goal on Nadu in the soccer game before he shot, uh, Khan said, "Good luck, Terrence." That was it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, but Kevin, you're right, yeah. and, and that's the right. thing that bothers me is that he's always got the kid gloves. And the special rules. No, and they're off. Like, I'm telling you right yeah. now, they are completely off. I'm I'm telling you right now. But he's going to watch this. Anymore. He's like, going to watch this. Do you think he reaches out to Nadu? And then you could say he just did it because we're. He, yeah, he's he, just doing it. Yeah. Kevin, here's, here's all I'll say, because I agree with everything you've said. He has no kid gloves with me whatsoever. I will not protect him. If people go after him, I will not tell them to, to back off. He has made his bed in that regard. The way I see it is. We hired a new guy who, if he can prove that he's a new guy, he has a job here. If he goes back to the same guy that's attacking people online, that's throwing high noon cans, he's done. Like, it's it. It's over. And, and he knows this. Big... I know. You know. I know. Like, and like, this like, is... Scott, I, like when you said on, on Pick'em, you were like, you were speaking metaphorically. You were like, if you're late to practice, no big deal. If you harass someone's wife, then we have a problem. It's like, yeah, no kidding. There's yeah. got to be some sort of like. It's well, what he said late to practice, I, I literally thought he meant like ten minutes late. That Listen, I, 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 I fucked up. I'm just saying, I fucked up. I misjudged the situation, and I feel bad because I feel like I might have put. I, I do think Cons is okay with it, but I do oh, worry Kahn's in the back of my head that I might have put him in a bad spot, even no. indirectly. But like, dude, you have no responsibility. This is Rico and Rico alone who who can't like the, the amount and I don't care. of yeah. lying that has to go into like the crying that went on about when people harass me public, uh, my personal life and 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 get you know, I don't want my family to be attacked and I don't want what happened to you to happen to me. And then to be one of those guys, like that yeah. is so unbelievable. Yeah, but Kevin, he's a psychopath. I'm telling you right now, <laughs> in his heart of hearts, so then, the difference is, Kevin, he thinks Khan deserves it because 18 years ago, he slighted him, but he's he'll, he'll a, never apologize. He, and he's if he a psychopath. Does, he doesn't mean it because he actually thinks. Well, Khan's we're going to treat guy. him like a ch and hand up. You know what you got to do? Put him in a, in a cage. Yeah, the, I've said that. Put him in the Hannibal Lecter. No, he gets no. He gets he, no pass. Able to like not interact or talk to anybody or even look at anybody in the company except for you guys. You let him out of the cage. You pick him and you put him back in. Well, I will say this. Listen, what he did was horrible. And yes, if other people did it, would I even go to cons? Maybe not. But he has been in our world for a decade. Even though I know he's the biggest piece of shit in the world, I think there's a part of me. That like I truly and maybe that's just me being unfair. I think he's a psychopath. He should be on meds, and we got to get him on meds. Get him on meds. Yeah. But also like Brandon Walker. Like there's other people. I guess it's bad. Brandon Walker, you shove a guy, you're out. Brandon Walker at a, a game day event, you take a helmet and someone calls you a hick. He took a helmet and threw it a hundred miles per hour into the crowd. If it hits somebody, they're dead. So like I we have people who yeah. do. Shit, we're not a normal company. Yeah. Rico is a psychopath. And he has the benefit of a 10-year relationship with me and Dan, specifically, and Hank. Original guys. And we like him, but you know he's a jerk and an asshole and a psychopath. And it, I guess it's like... Well, no, give I him mean, one more you don't I mean, want. Hank, he, Hank, like his life is over. This Hank is used burners Hank. against us. I mean, True. that's... We, there Hank, is call like, me a... Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, you, you've always said you've always said you you know different people get the different benefit of the doubt i just think that for the rest of the company it's like uh, i i you know that's where i feel like i, I agree they're, they're just like and and you're and what you're saying is true like I, I don't think you would ever treat someone unfairly because of the way you have a relationship with rico or whatever everybody kind of gets treated accordingly but it does seem like what is this about? Like, I, like, like the next time you choose somebody out for 
something you know minimal it's going to be like well the uh, yeah, psychopath no, girl, attempted murderer and civilian You're attacker right. is is okay but i'm getting chewed out because i didn't put up enough blogs or something you know yeah no that's a fair point but i mean again it, it I, I i am trusting in the in and, and again, you could argue, well, you shouldn't even give it a cons. Once you did that, he's out. Yeah, well, I, I, I think from your point of view, are you going to be comfortable? Like, you're basically placing a bet. You're basically placing your faith and you're putting all your marbles in, like, his basket <clears throat> to not fuck up again or not do something crazy No, I again. think he'll fuck up if again. Because it does, yeah. You, 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 well, I just hopefully not murder anybody. But, yeah, well, I, I, I mean, though, like, first of all, that, that thought of, like, what if he just does the high noon thing again and this time? But, well, that's, well, I mean, that, that, then, then we're looking just, this should have been the one it was after I listen when the contract, right. and, and the contract, the contract, the contract, which he hadn't signed when this all happened, I had Erica add a line that said he can be fired with or without cause for any reason anything. at anything. Yeah. Yeah. Like if, if you look at me the wrong way, you're out. This but, is, but in general, like as a guy, like I know you value, but I don't worry about that stuff because he's just a psychopath. But, but it, from the way other people will look at you, as a guy who values loyalty and like logic and telling the truth and, and, and treating people like fair, at least in their own way, like how, you know, and you, you're going to put, you're basically putting like your reputation on the line for Rico. For Rico. Well, I don't like, done. I don't like, I don't like when you say it that way. I, I don't like, <laughs> no, listen, I've been, that's, that's like going to mob going, boss, be like, you're going through no. my head. It's like, all saying, hey, so where's like, for this guy, you know, and, and you run into somebody, you know, out. No, I would never vouch for Rico. Rico. No, that's what you're doing basically by having him work with you. And Kevin, work with us. Kevin, that's literally been going through my head all day because you can't, like, why am I putting myself through this to, I, and yeah. it just, I just go back to the fact that like, he broke down to me about like supporting his family and his kids. And it's yeah, just like, yeah, I, yeah. no, I get that. I, I fucking, I, it's, I, it like breaks me up to be like, why, like, why can't you just walk away from someone? And that's, I don't know. And, and, and I hope, I hope he's different. And I, I really mean it when I say that like, he has zero tolerance with me, zero, like no, anyone who wants to go after him, go for it. Anyone who wants to talk shit to him, anyone who wants to say anything, well, I'm not defending. Too. I don't want to. No, but I'm saying I'm not say, defending I'm not. him because I don't want anyone in the office to think that I'm defending him anymore. If he fucks up, if someone comes up to me and says, Rico did this to me, I'm going to be like, all right, well, he's got to go. Like, I'll tell Dave, well, he's got to go because he he has no rope, zero rope with me, zero. Yeah. Like, I, I'm like not, I'm it's not, like, nothing. buying for him to get fired. I don't like doing that. I don't like to, you know. I, no, I, I want him to work out. I want it to work Listen, out. But it's this, like, this could be a mitzvah for the whole company. If he turns it around... We saved the life because if he's not here, I honestly, you're joking. What's he going to do? I know. And that, but you yeah. know, if, if you feel bad, but it's also like, well, then you probably, you know, how many times, first of all, you should have like recognized that about yourself and not even gone down this road of trying to play hardball and saying I'm better than this person and better than that person. And then after something like the big T thing, you definitely should have figured your shit out and calmed your shit down. And it's like, he just keeps, yeah, well, you know, Kevin, Con, 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 to his defense, Con said, "Good, good luck, Terry." <laughs> no, no, stop. <laughs> stop. That's not. Yeah, I know it's funny, but man, I, I mean, it's it such is a trigger funny. issue for me with like the 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 burner stuff and attacking families. If you've gone through any of that kind of shit, is so low and like it's the I lowest mean, you can do. I can't even imagine that phone call of having to. Be like, yep, it was me. No, I, I would count, and I did that. Is like the most. I, I would have quit. I would have been like, I can't do that. I have to move somewhere else. I can't even believe he wants to come back. Con, anymore. Cons but, is like twenty times better than conscience. Either it's like, you're right. I don't know what he would do that as company, and I don't nothing. Know he has no us, listen. So my he he he's he's toxic. He's radioactive. The yeah. only place before, even before we thought he was coming back, Dan, I said, I go, what type of. Like if if I knew what Rico was and he was new to my company, I'd be like, I'm not touching you with the ten foot pole. Like the only way he can survive here is the good. It's not even goodwill. Is and, and people go, oh, well, he's only with you, you and Dan. Yeah, well, he landed in the right spot. And for everything people say, I get it. There, there is, there's. It's hard to like. 
it's almost hard to reconcile what an asshole he is with how he interacts with us, but he is. But yeah. it's like... Well, like, even like with, with me, like I, I haven't talked to him and I I was very, uh, um, I was very empathetic towards him. Like I was kind of like almost pushing him to leave being like, it sounds like you're not happy. So just go, you know, like it's not the end of the world. You don't have to work for Barstool. If it's not working, then go. And, and you know, we talked about mental health and all that. And then when I heard, when I found this out, I do a 180 and I said to myself, I should text them because I don't like talking about people online if I haven't like said it to their face or at least to them and I was like I'm not even going to do that I want to see if he'll reach out to me I want to see what he does and like I'm not going to hear from him I won't hear a peep because he knows he's wrong and he's not gonna you mean you texted him I have not no he didn't Uh oh oh. no you're right I I, you know you ordinarily anybody else I probably would but I bet I bet we'll just go and he'll never say anything to me because he doesn't have to because he doesn't need me the way he needs you to so he'll do whatever you guys say. Yeah, there's a part else. of that 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 is alarming, and you know, maybe more to come that he's just a a liar and, and like doing yeah. whatever he has to do but, to survive. Right. It, it, and from my perspective, if he doesn't like, if you tell me in two weeks, like, yeah, he never reached. Like that's a ding. Yeah, I'm, but like, we're I'm, already Dan. To... We are what we did are here. We already are telling him. Like I, I was. I know. Hoping now he's gonna he go do it. Out, I'm right. told, you're right. You're right. Yeah. You're right. You're right. The new thing will be the big test. If he he either does content with the new or he doesn't. And if he doesn't, I don't think Never he's mind like, that. He should have already called him and yeah. been like, yo, yes. I was an asshole. And even if he doesn't believe it, because who knows, at least it's him swallowing his pride. Right. But again, we just laid the game plan because the cons okay. thing, it yeah. was like he never relented faster than he did when I was on the phone. I'm like, you it, it, before you even talk, it's up to cons. Like I like I will not hire you if he has any hesitation. And he's like, all right, let me call him. It's also different now that it's like so many people. You know, if it was just like the ten guys that it used to be, it's it almost is like let's figure it out in the locker room. We've got a crazy player, and I don't know. But like, there's so many people. There's young kids. There's girls. There's people who don't know how to handle Rico, and they like everybody's got to be. Someone does have to sit next to him now, or you got to see him in the office, or you know, you, you don't know if you're his next victim or whatever. You know, it's it's a it's not fun. Not going to be easy. But I still have that old like bars. I just want him in like the Hannibal Lecter, like. Well, that why place. doesn't he just? I mean, just like then he's not allowed to come in the office ever. He just does like, you know, your shows and that's it. Yeah, I mean, I'm, no, I mean, I mean, nobody. I'm fine with that. Nobody's on his side now. I can't imagine anybody is going to be like, "Hey, you want to pop on my show? Hey, let's do, let you know, let's do the scene for stool scenes. Uh, can you do the rundown for me today? Like, you know, it's it's just it is just you guys. I don't know if I don't know if there's a I don't know about that. I think there's still some people who just are apathetic or don't really care. I like judging from the office and like the vibe. There are people that are very, very mad that it's rightfully so. Me and Dave. And then I think there's a ton of people who, like, don't really care. or Like, he's not really – it just doesn't – they don't have interactions with him or the interactions they've had with him have been nice, so they don't really care. So I don't know if everyone is, like, he's the worst person in the world. I think there's just a lot of people who are, no, like, but I, I think he's radioactive. I think it, that's true because, you know, not everybody interacts with everybody and does content with everybody. But if you asked people and said, like, here's – Here's what this guy has done, and here's his ledger. Yeah. There's nobody like again. I uh, in the past certain. He's the son. Of, he's the son of 15. Sam. He's the son of Sam. Yeah, like he's, he's, he's he's untouchable. He's so radioactive now that maybe they don't outwardly hate him, but if they said, "Do you want him on your show or whatever?" Here's the kind of shit he does. Do you want to get involved with this guy? He might end up throwing a can at your head or attacking your wife. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing I'm gonna say to that is he's so goddamn crazy. And I do think, like, he needs, he's, needs to be on meds. Like, I'm not just saying that. I think he has a biological imbalance. He's a crazy person. Where if you start taking meds and maybe he comes back, it's like, well, you know, that was off the meds, Rico. On the meds, Rico, we saved a life. Because I, I'm not exaggerating. I think he has, like, what we're describing 
Like, Kevin, yeah. what you said, like, hey, I need privacy. He doesn't let his name be said. You can't say he has a family. Like, he goes crazy. And then he turns around and attacks yeah. a what? Like, that is loony yeah, tunes. Like schizo type shit. It's insane. Yes. It's yeah. insane. Yes. It's insane when you, when, you, when you write it all down. It's fucking insane. But that is, you know, I guess it's just like. Uh, it's, I, Wait, what are we gonna throw this guy in the world? Uh, just, well, you know, if, if you and if he murders somebody somewhere else, it's on us. We're, we're if, fucked if we either way. I know that this is the whole crux of it is that you have a ten year history with him. But if you didn't, you wouldn't stand up or put no. your name on the line for this guy. No, oh, no, no. If, no if we didn't have the ten years, if this was Caroline who attacks somebody who just came in or John Rest, they're gone. No, it's that's, also it's also Kevin yeah. like. But that's human nature. He, he doesn't even even the history aside. I don't know what the fuck he would do. So when he calls me and he's like, "I don't know how to provide, provide for my family," like I don't either. Like this is that's the job. Did, like go it, blog. Why did you like rock the boat this much? If you ever thought I don't, I, I honestly, I, I, honestly, provide I, for your family. I think he probably, which is bad because anytime you say he thought that makes sense. That's bad for him. Yeah. But maybe when he did it, he's like, I'm done with Barstool. Yeah. Because he I, did I say that that was the end. That he didn't have an offer. I still think that's all bullshit. He, he did say, he did say that that was the end. Like that last month, he we was can out. Maybe. So maybe. Cut this yeah. out. We, we want to catch it. We'll see. And almost maybe it's a test. He had an offer. He did verbally. That is. That's what I mean. Verbally. I, now, I whether that, like, I, I heard was, I heard that the offer was gone because they started doing research. There right. is okay, a gray true. area yeah. whether he knew that or not. That I don't know. Right, but that's what I mean. Like, there is a very big difference. They're like, I've got the Which, job. Which, by the way, paper. if he's listening to this, we will find out what yeah. the truth is. So, if I were him, he should say it. I would lead with the truth from this point forward on everything he's ever done, because if it turns out he's been lying about that part too, that's tough too. Like what, what, what's he got to do to, to, uh, you know, to get get fired. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, Like it feels like it's just out of pity and I do get it because I know you got, you got a conscience and you know, you don't want any, any, anything bad to happen to anybody, but it's like, it's not, you know, your responsibility or anybody's, else's fault that like he put himself in a spot where he doesn't have any other offers or any other you know it's like yeah you 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 you, you're a child who's been you know screaming and yelling and having outbursts your whole life and now i honestly think when nobody is here to take care of you it's crazy thinking about it all today like i honestly think the the best course of action is he should just he should just be like a remote blogger and and go to therapy and work on himself and see if he can fucking fix himself because I don't know if like you're you're right, Kevin. Like him being here, I don't know. Like I, it's and that solves the problem of like I don't want him to not have a job and see what that entails. He's but, just like, proven like this job is like fifty percent doing the content and fifty percent being able to handle yourself in this world. Yeah, and he can kind of do the content a little bit, and he. Zero percent. Well, total failure on the other. Well, hand. the problem, which we we've discussed at length, what makes his content truly electric in some of the most memorable content, honestly, that we've had is when he's being a total psychopath and people think yeah, it's a right bit off, Ian, that. You, do you think that fans knowing now that it comes from a place of like that, like it's, it changes it? Yeah, like it used to be like. It's it changes it. funny that he's so mad at this guy because he didn't say hello to him at a baseball game. It's not funny that he harassed his wife separately on the internet. It's not funny that he almost like smashed someone's face into pieces. It's like that now the psychopath thing kind of becomes like, why, why, why are we, you know, what are we, yeah. why is this funny? What is this? You know, it's, it's, it's a very, it's, it's hard awesome. to come back from that. I wish sometimes I wish Hank never had picked up that phone call. Hank's still riding hard as ever, which is there crazy the, because he the, didn't ride for Hank. The riders are are few and far between at this point. It feels like, and uh, it's it's like so. this is a very this is one of those moments where this is very barstool insular, 
where we feel like this is, you know, the biggest no, thing I, in the world. And, you know, not anybody outside of no, Marvel. Oh, no, of course not. I, I, had, I, Marvel, so don't care. I had so many people tweet me today being like, I'm never consuming any of your content again. I know that it's going to pass. It just sucks right now because I do feel bad for the coworkers if anyone feels uncomfortable and that's fucked up. Like, I, I misjudged that part. Yeah, I, I don't, you know, like if... if I don't pe- think people feel uncomfortable. It's like, what the fuck? I just think, no, I think they're, I think they think it's not fair. Yeah, I think they're like, I it's think not I, fair. I think there's a level of hypocrisy. Yeah, that yeah is. right. Oh, yeah, that's what I fucking. Yes. Up. That's yeah. well, Manny Ramirez flew the, tr- through the traveling secretary down a flight of stairs. That's, that's the problem is that you're calling Rico Bosco Manny. No, Ramirez. I'm He's just using this He's not hitting 40 home runs. That's what I mean. That That is the issue. Well, like, I didn't give him more money. You know, Let me ask you this. Last hypothetical. If, uh. Yeah, he Doc- did not get a raise, by the way. We should just make sure that's very clear. Yes. People thinking that, like, that's crazy. He did if, not get a raise. If a doctor looked at his brain and he's like, he's schizo. And, like, when he's doing what he does, he actually thinks he's in the right. He's like, he, he doesn't, like, he thinks because he got slighted, he's being a man of honor. He thinks because Gottlieb took the credit card, he's standing up for justice. He thinks because cons called him Terrence that he has to say, if he's like, he thinks that's black and white, he's right. Mm-hmm. A doctor said that. He's got to be on meds. Would you th- Would you be like, all right, let's, because I think that's what his brain does. I don't think, I think he thinks he's like a superhero. I, I know what you mean, and then when he acts out like this, it's definitely you know a check in, in the in the column for you're right. But I've heard you say before, like none of it is shtick. But I've had moments with him where he's been like, I know what's going on here. No, he doesn't, Kevin. But Kevin, I'm saying he says oh, he never yeah. got it. No, he says that though. All the he 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 says that, but he doesn't. He try. He's yeah, that's that's, question, question that's a calling me. card of his. Like, oh, okay. I know what's going on. He he doesn't. Yeah, he doesn't. He, he doesn't never. He has never had it. From the first time we had dinner with him, 10, 12 years ago, I knew he was crazy. I didn't know he was this crazy, right. but I've known now how crazy he. Now, right? Did I think he go after a what? No. Am I? Was I like? Oh my god, that's the most stunning thing. Unfortunately, no. Like yeah. I, I've come that's to believe he's part. capable of anything. I just, he's never changed at all. And no. that could be the good part. Yeah, no, that's the right. Content, it right. Was like, he'll be just as crazy in a week. But now when it's like you need to seriously change things. and Well, it's elevated, it. obviously. It, it got worse with the can. Well, he's in the office. You know, yeah. you, this is, it's a new thing. To throw in the can, obviously, you spend them for a month, you think. But th- I think he thought he was, which is bad again for his argument, because then it shows logic. I think he thought he was out the door when he went after Khan's yeah. wife. Did you yeah. hear the reason he said that he, yeah, and terror. I don't know if it's yeah, true. No, no the, the soccer thing, it. right? Yeah. No, no, no. The oh. reason he said when he decided he was leaving. Oh, yeah. What was that? So oh, yeah. He, the, the Snowden tweet. I said yeah. he had him in a, a chokehold choke because hold. he was talking to him for a while. And that's yeah. where it's like, it's what are, like, what? What are we even talking about? Yeah, here? yeah, because <laughs> we also, me and, me and Feidelberg, it's crazy. me and Feidelberg both got like goodbye talks and speeches before all this. And he said that to John. He said he was like, you know, like, I, I got to be a man who can like have a conversation with another man without somebody telling him that I'm talking his ear off. It's like, what? <laughs> you, you, you acted like that was such an affront to him as like a man. It's like, that's just and that's, that's funny, funny though. That's, that's funny, man. his reaction. That's <laughs> that the is... thing that kills me is like when he gets that mad, about people tweeting pictures of him photoshopped in Afghanistan and being like, <laughs> I never fought with ISIS. It's like, that's yeah, funny. Dude, but it's, it's God. Thing, like, your feathers fly. He, he's quick. He is smart. He is witty. I get it. At what cost? And, and, you know, I don't know. The feathers are flying everywhere and everyone's getting hit with them. So we'll what have to see. Is, you know what? Like, Rigo Bosco was gr- perfect for a phone call on your radio yes. show at, at Friday at 4.59 before the weekend starts and you play the music and that's it. When you say small doses, I mean the smallest fucking dose imaginable because when you get into the big doses, this is what happens. I just, it's just like, I think something else will happen. I would put my money on he's going to do something else that is equally as bad or... Well, the thing is... What? How many times I, 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 it? It's like he can't exist unless he starts ramping up. And if he starts ramping up, then he's going to kill somebody. And and if you are 
already only doing this because he is so radioactive he can't have a job anywhere else well let me tell you the, the next time something happens it's just gonna be worse yeah it's like i you know go you, you gotta go get a job like you gotta push you gotta be like a desk job somewhere you gotta like work in a factory i don't know like so i'm saying i think he should oh, just blog he should just there. blog 15 you times a day he'd kill somebody in the factory yeah, uh, yeah, you're he, right. It's he, like maybe you don't need to. Maybe you can't be in the workforce until you figure your shit out. I don't know, but it's, I told him. I told him when he was when he was deciding to leave. I was like, "You're making a mistake, dude. Just sit at home all day and blog 15 times a week, and you have the best job in the world." And maybe that's the answer. He does that. He gets therapy, and maybe he can re-enter into the world. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I guess if you just stay uh, uh, alone, away from people, and blog, but it it, it, it just will feel. I think people. The way we're it, talking you know, about him. Maybe we can turn, we can re-enter the world. Like he can't be yeah, he's got to learn how to people. walk. He's got to have like run. a big bubble, like Bubble Boy inside. Like, like stay away. Danger his head popping out of a bubble, rolling down the street, like with all these signs just to stay away from him. He's not ready to re-enter the world yeah, he's yet. Not, uh, right anyway, I just he's stay don't away. talk to him. He's in, like, he can't turn his head. Oh, that's... I have a soft spot for him, but he is crazy. He is fucking yeah. crazy. And he he's may so kill crazy. somebody one day. And, like, who knows what else he's done, you know? Like, it makes me question oh. everything about everything. No, I mean, that's he's definitely attacked he's me. He's definitely Curtis. come after me. Yeah. I think oh. I, we know. We proved that he attacked what, 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 us. What were Curtis. the YouTube comments you were referring to on the oh, show? Oh, it was just, they, he says it's not him. Who knows? Very, very. Maybe a soldier. Very pro. Somebody was out there with a lot of details that yeah, you wouldn't think one would have. Comments. Someone DM'd him to me. I was like, what is this? What am I looking at? Dude, the, the whole, I didn't know that, like, the whole, like, lieutenant and army thing oh, was actually. Oh, it's so, the hype circle. Those are the biggest losers this coming, on the yeah. planet. If you're one of those people, Rico and even Jerry, I like Jerry, but if you do another man's bidding on the internet or something, well, you're a fucking loser. The, the best part, Kevin, I had to point out to him last night on Pick'em, he's like, you know, all the time when someone will attack someone, he'd be like, well, that wasn't me. That was one of my soldiers. And it's like. That's Dude, sense. they literally created a law called the RICO Act. Right. Yeah. That if you fucking tell someone to go do something, you are if you cr associate with criminals in a criminal organization, you are a criminal. And, and and it's one of those things that's like you know when you see uh and we said this too, it's like a terrorist organization and like there's always a couple of the, of the people in the terrorist organizations like you're not being hardcore enough and they go do their own splinter cells and they <laughs> that's what's happened. Right. He has his own that's cells who cells. have like spun off and he can't control them that's his that's 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 part of the problem too then you know it's like even if rico maybe changes what about his, his, his yeah, you gotta yeah, put him in spawn. arkham arkham asylum with the goddamn joker i mean my god all right well i guess we'll see i mean he's gonna watch this and he's not gonna get it but he may react based on what we said you'd like to see somehow at him Take the initiative On to show them. correct all of them. Yeah. Like every feud, he's got a fucking squash. It's so and annoying too, though, because it's like you know, I I I don't even want to deal with it. I'm sure there's a bunch of other people who don't too. So it's like, yeah, okay, whatever, man. And then that just enables him again, you know? Yeah. Like there's got to be somebody who says like, no, well, like, if he I'm not enabling him, I know people will think it's not true, and they'll like. I, He's got nothing with me right now. He's got to. He's got to basically prove that he is a totally different person for me to ever be like. I trust you. I like respect like anything. And he, let me say this: we have one more pick him, and then he's basically out in the wilderness where it's like I'll tell him what to do. But it, it, if he if he does anything, it's like you're on your own, bro. And, and let me say this: Barcelona is definitely not a democracy. So ultimately, I can make the decision with content. But in this case. If content all came together, like, we're not going to work unless you get a Rico. That's a no-brainer. I'm not dying on the Rico sword. All right. Like, I, was the, actually, the, I was literally just about to ask you that question. The, this is not something. It's the same as what I said, the cons. But if everyone came and, like, we're not comfortable, this is fine. Like, I, like he has ex – this, I made the decision. Dan was on board with it. It's not something – 
he, he's lost me. I'm not going to bleed my own blood. If that's how people feel in this company strongly enough, fine. If I'll Khan's make... came back and said, Correct. you know what, I have a second thought. 100%. I don't want to do this. We're, we're gonna I'd be like, a, cool. We're going to have a scene like. Like the Rudy, everyone. Um, all, yeah. I'm just going to drop it. But, but I do like, think I there's mean, a part of our company is like you don't want to throw this dude into the world. You'd like to believe maybe he can change. Who knows? Well, yeah, I think most people don't want to have. I don't. I don't ever like to get people fired when we beef with people and someone tracks down your boss and tries to tell you like I hate all that. I don't want anybody to get fired. But it, it's also like there's got to be some some rules. For, I gotta for, just stop. For, I gotta like rewire my own brain and stop trusting people in general. And just become one of those people who's like, I don't trust anyone. Well, I mean, honestly, how can you not? But we've known Bosco for over. I know, years. I know. It's but yeah, you, it's, you know, it's, it's like, did, would you prior to this, if someone said like, Rico will fuck with your wife behind your back? Yeah, no, I'd okay. yeah. Oh, if you no, told I, me he would do that on his hate list, I, I, yeah, I would. On his hate list, it. yeah, yeah, I guess. But it, I mean, I but told not, you, Kevin, no. when we talked on the phone earlier, he's so crazy that when. Cons hit me up and was like, tell Rico to stop tweeting my wife. And I told him right away, stop fucking do what are you fucking doing, dude? But like in my head, I was like, it it wasn't surprising, which is it, that's a problem. That's right. A problem. That, I mean, but he that's has, also he like, has, like normalized this. Yeah, with yeah, guys. no, that's a problem. Like, I, I acknowledge not. that's now a problem, but like yeah. that's how crazy is that like his like he doesn't someone someone like looks at him the wrong way and he's like, That person's dead to me. It's like, what? Yeah, but that's yeah. No, I, I, I think if you were to ask everybody, do you want them to work here? They would say no. But if you were to like put them to a vote or something, what it was a silent vote. I, I, I think I it would think, be, I think, I think it would be like, I think it would be like 60, 40. I don't I think, think it would be as, oh, as no, no, no. as if, if it was like, you have to vote your, your real feelings. I think it would be like 90, 10. But I think no, that's get rid I, of them. You, you're not yeah. in the game. You're not in the gambling guys world. Like the gambling guys don't, I think the gambling guys would just be like, yeah, he's funny. And yeah, like, because to be honest, the people we were around, rough and rowdy, and they knew it all, they were not, they were more like, oh, Rico. And, and that's yeah. a bad thing, but it's almost like, oh, Rico. Yeah, well, like he's, Rico. He's, whatever, he's, whatever the numbers are, like, I don't know how many people are gambling versus non gambling. I think if the people who are not around him, if they were being totally honest, would say, like, I don't want this guy to be a coworker of mine. I don't want him at my company. If if it was like, you will be responsible for someone getting fired now. And as we're saying, he's going to be like unable to provide for his family. Well, but, but that is, the, would, yeah, that is the vote. Like if you did a right, silent right. vote, That's I would never going to say who it is. Yeah. It's a yeah. silent vote. Everyone knows him. Like, what's he going to yeah. do? But so that's like bullshit. It's like, that's so fucking cheap, you know? It's like I no, have to I, I, that's the part where I should to be an adult. You you screwed and, up. And that is where it's on me. Now I have to worry about yeah, that. That's, that's, that's where too. it's on me because we have said, but he doesn't even believe it. He has gotten away with more for doing less than anybody in the history of this company. He's gotten away with murder. Anybody, anybody, no doubt. And no and doubt. little little ticky tack things, and then things that are like you know, yeah. He won't illegal. work. He won't blog. He'll try attempted murder. Bang, yeah. bang. Right. Attack your wife, won't blog. Bang, bang. Uh, Takes another uh, job, comes back, maybe had it, maybe didn't. Who knows? It, if you had a Hollywood script of this, they would throw it out. <laughs> They're like, this is and not you, real. And honestly, the you know what the, the real way it should be done is, like, Cons and his wife are being so gracious about it because even she was like, I feel, she said, I feel bad for him. Yeah, I, no, she, she's I know, like I know a he's saint. not good in a, in, a, in a good mental spot, so, like, I feel like people are piling, piling on and I feel bad. Would Rico ever show the no. same grace? Oh, no, 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 no. And the answer is no. no. And so that's why no. nobody no. should show him the same no. sympathy because he would no. leave you for dead. He would but be he, the first one to vote you out in a heartbeat. But, but he, and I'm not saying this facetiously, he's sick. He's sick. Well, yeah, then it's like he should go away somewhere and fix it. And he not, should. You know, that honestly, going to therapy. He, honestly, though, he may have to go to like a three month, you don't see anybody yeah. like thing. Because you know what, you where you. Where you absolutely don't figure that stuff out is like that's on what I'm TV show, basically, which is I, what we do. You know, that's why I think he should just blog and go to therapy. Like yeah. that's what he should do for like two months and re-enter the world. It's crazy, man. Crazy. I swear, this side of the Kardashians, there's no better reality show than this. No. Wild. No. No. <sighs> All right. <laughs> that's the rundown. <laughs>